shoulders are down, palms pressed into the mat, fingertips relaxed. Start with our breathing. Inhale through your nose and exhale out your mouth. Good. A few big inhales and exhales here. Just checking in with your body. Pushing away the thoughts from outside, focusing in here on your practice. As you continue here, inhaling, feeling that rib cage open. Exhale, pull the rib cage together, belly button the spine. Perfect. Knees are bent, feet flat, palms are just still on the mat. Get a little rotation here. Let the knees go one direction as your gaze goes the opposite direction. Just finding some rotation of the spine. Inhale it back to center and exhale to switch. Good. Continuing here, just finding some movement to the spine. Breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth. Perfect. Good. Pausing back at center. Knees are bent, feet flat. You're going to open the knees into a nice butterfly. Close the knees. Continuing here, just still finding your breath, warming up, letting those hips open, and bringing it back together. Good. We'll pause with both knees bent, feet flat on the ground. We're gonna take the legs one at a time to tabletop. Right leg to tabletop, left leg to tabletop. Knees are over the hips, shins are parallel to the ground, starting with some toe taps. Right toe taps down to the mat, bring it back to tabletop. Left toe taps down, back to tabletop, good. Continuing here, finding that hinge from the hip, taking it nice and slow and controlled. As you go through these toe taps, don't let the lower back arch you're going too far. If that happens, you want to keep the core nice and engaged in that neutral spine position. We're going to pause with both legs in tabletop. Adding on, double leg toe tap. Both toes tap down towards the mat. Don't let the back arch bring it back to tabletop. A few more like this, just starting to warm up the core as you go, really finding that engagement of those core muscles here. Keeping that low back either in that neutral position or pressing down into the mat to protect it. Good. You can always take the arms out to a T if you want that modification. We're going to do one more like this. Perfect. And then set both feet flat on the mat. Arms come up to 90, palms face away. Inhale. Exhale. Hands come to the hips. Inhale back up to 90, 100 prep. For our hundreds here. You can add a chest lift when the hands come to the hips, not required. You can keep your feet flat on the mat. As we go into our hundreds, you can take the legs to tabletop 90 or a challenge position. We'll be pumping our arms five or six inches deliberate pumps. Breathing in for five pounds and out for five pounds for 100 counts. On this next one, we'll start pumping for our hundreds. Breathing in, two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, five, 20. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, thirty. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, forty. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, fifty. Halfway done. On your exhales, if you're in that chest lift, try to scoop up one more inch. Good. Maybe you add a challenge on. Maybe you take a hand behind the head if you need that modification. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, seventy. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, eighty. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, 90. Last step, breathe in. Last step, breathe out. And set it on down. Catch your breath. Take a big inhale and an exhale. We're gonna continue warming up the core here, going into our scissors. Right leg straight at 90, left leg 45. Hands can go behind the thigh or the calf. Chest lift optional, pulse, pulse, switch, pulse, pulse, switch. The goal is to keep the legs straight here, both legs straight like a scissor. Pulse, pulse, switch, pulse, pulse, switch. Good, warming up the core, breathing in, breathing out. You guys got this, we're here for five, four, three, two, one, set it down, take an inhale and an exhale. 
We're gonna grab that booty band for this next set. So uh, booty band optionally, you can do this without the booty band. Booty band's gonna go on the arches of the feet. So I have it on both arches of the feet. Good. Hands are gonna come behind the head, elbows wide. You can always keep your head down on the mat if you want that modification. Otherwise, I'm gonna come up into a chest lift. Chest lift, hands behind head. We're gonna go single leg stretch. Right knee bends, left leg extends, and switch. Switch, again, you can always set the head down if you need. Find the core muscles here as well. Gaze stays towards the thighs in that chest lift. Breathing in, breathing out, single leg stretch. Good. We're here for five, four, three, two, one. Feet to the mat, set the head down, take an inhale and an exhale. We're gonna keep the band on the feet for one more um, here. We're moving into our crisscross neck. So again, hands behind the head, elbows wide, chest lift optional. If you're adding on here. Let's come to tabletop. We go right shoulder to left knee, right leg shoots out to 45, and then we crisscross to switch. Rotating, finding that rib to hip oblique work here. Breathing in, breathing out, keep the elbows wide. Try to stay up in a chest lift through the center. Booty band is optional, you guys got this. Perfect, warming up those obliques. We're here for five, four, three, two, one. Set it down, take an inhale and an exhale. The booty band is gonna slide either um, below the knees or above the knees depending on how that feels for you. You can always ditch the booty band to at any point. We're gonna go into our bridging next. So knees are bent, feet flat, shoulders down. You have that neutral spine, that little pocket of air underneath the low back. Take the feet about um, hip width there. So you have a little bit of pressure out on that booty band. You can even go a little further if you want a little more. Take the legs together if you want a little bit less with the booty band. Starting with the pelvic rock, inhale, exhale. All we're doing to begin is exhaling, pressing the low back down, finding that little tilt, inhale back to neutral. So nothing's moving except for that low back. It's an inhale, neutral, exhale, press down. Little scoop, little curl to find the core, inhale back to neutral. If you have anything going on in the back today, as we go into our bridging, you can hinge up and down instead of rolling through the spine. Good. As we continue through our bridging, try to keep that pressure out on the booty band. We're gonna inhale, exhale, press the low back down, slowly lift, one bone at a time, lifting your hips into that diagonal, squeeze the glutes at the top, inhale, exhale, nice and slow, rolling all the way back down. Good, continuing here with your breath, nice and slow and controlled, rolling up, <clears throat> keeping that pressure out on the booty band, even pressure in the feet, no strain in the neck or the shoulders. So we warmed up the front body with those core exercises. Now we're warming up the posterior chain, the back, the glutes. On this next one, we're just gonna hold up in that bridge, holding nice and strong, glutes are active. Kneecap shoot away, one inch up, one inch down. Little hip dip. Good, breathing in, breathing out. Squeeze the glutes as you press up. We're here for five, four, three, two, one. Hold up, keeping the hips lifted, glutes active. Open the band, close the band. Open the band, close the band. Working those outer thighs, you guys got this. We're here for five, keep the core closed. Three, two, one. Inhale, exhale nice and slow. Roll all the way back down. Good, extend the legs up to 90 for a second. Get a little hamstring stretch. <clears throat> All right, <clears throat> you can stick with that first option, keeping both feet flat on the mat. Otherwise, we're gonna add on. <clears throat> we're going to single leg bridging. Left foot stays on the mat, right leg comes to tabletop. If you need to adjust the band, you can move it up or down. Again, it's okay if it's, if it's a little bit not all the way to tabletop, you're still gonna find that bridge. Inhale, exhale, press up into your bridge. Inhale, exhale, come back down. You should really start to feel those outer thighs 
as we hinge up and down in that single leg bridge. Try to keep the hips level as you come up and down. Good job, guys. On this next one, we're holding up. Hold up in that single leg bridge. Tap the right toe down, back up. Good, we're here for five. You got it, four, three, two, one. Inhale, exhale, hinge down. Good job, guys. Other side. Not there for long, but you should be starting to feel it. Right foot down on the mat, left leg to tabletop, starting with that bridge. Inhale, exhale, hinge up. Inhale, exhale, hinge back down. Good. Continuing here. <clears throat> Try to keep those hips level as you press up. Neck and shoulders are relaxed. We're gonna hold up on this bridge. Left toe tap down and back up. Keep the hips lifted. Keep the um, pelvis tilted there. You don't wanna arch the back. We're here for three, two, one. Inhale, exhale, hinge down. Good, we're gonna take the band back to the arches of the feet to get a nice stretch. So you can use that band to find your hamstring stretch here. Optional, point and flex the toes if that feels good. Breathing in, breathing out. Good. We're gonna set the band off to the side. Legs come out back to the mat. Arms are gonna come up to 90, palms face each other. Inhale, exhale, chin to chest. We're gonna see her rolling all the way up. You can always grab the side. Get a nice forward fold. And then we'll stack back up nice and tall. We're gonna be seated here for a minute. And we'll grab the band here in a second. Let's take feet about um, hip width apart. Arms are gonna come out in front. Zombie arms, pull those shoulder blades down. We're gonna inhale, exhale. We're gonna reach forward as you press the low back behind. Gaze goes down, sitting spine stretch. Inhale to stack back up nice and tall. Good. Exhale, reach. Imagine your spine is a capital C. Inhale, back up. Couple more like this. Really pressing that low back away as you reach forward. Whole belly button to spine. Good. Last one here. And stack it back up nice and tall. A little shoulder roll. Take a big inhale and an exhale. Arms are going to come out to a T. Palms facing down. Pull those shoulder blades down. Inhale. Exhale. Pulse, pulse. One direction. Back to center. Pulse, pulse. The other way. Good. Try to imagine your spine is going up and over. So you're finding length here. The sits bones are nice and grounded, and you're finding the twist here in the core. So less shoulder work, more core work. Go one more side to side here, finding that rotation of the spine. Good. Shoulders down, butterfly the knees, keep a little forward pull. All right, we're gonna add the band for this last one here. So legs are gonna go out in front. I'm gonna put the band over my left arch of the foot, and then my right hand is gonna hold the band. Again, you wanna be squared off towards the front there, so pull those shoulder blades down. Hand is holding the band. Opposite hand is gonna come to the head. You're stacked up nice and tall, gaze forward. You're gonna pull back as you rotate open return to start. So it's like a narrow row with that right hand. You're gonna open up to the left side to rotate. Return it back to start. A few more like this. Pulling narrow row, open. Return to start. Try to keep the wrist strong here. Again, we all have different kinds of bands, so it's gonna feel different for each of us here. We're gonna hold back on this last one. Pull, narrow row, open, little pulse, reach that elbow back, twisting, yeah? We're here for five, four, three, two, one, return to start, we'll go other side. Band over the right arch of the foot, left hand holds the band, right hand comes behind the head. Again, try to square off first, shoulders are down, 
You're gonna pull that narrow row over to the right. Return to start. Good. Pull, narrow row, and open. And you can do this without the band if you don't have the band. Try to keep both feet on the mat, not moving. We have two more like this. Finding that resistance here. Last one, we're gonna hold little pulses. Band on stick over here for five. Four, three, two, one. Bring it back, take the band off. Good, band sets to the side, little forward fold, butterfly to knees. 